Thanks, Tiffany. Two children ages 11 and 14 and three adults wounded within 48 hours of gun violence in the city of Mobile. Today, officers arrested a man they say shot the 14 year old girl last night. WKRG News 5's Dana Winter shows you why this particular case appears to have drawn the line, leaving officers saying enough. I didn't do it. It was evident. That's 18 year old Lamagne Forrest being taken to Metro Jail. Officers say Forrest shot and killed 14 year old Sierra Jackson. This 23rd homicide of the year is heartbreaking to me personally. Sierra's 14. She died on the street named after Michael Donald, who was the last known lynching by the Ku Klux Klan in 1980. 40 years later, more innocent blood is shed on that street that's supposed to memorialize the death, sacrificed. And a black girl is gunned down on that street by a black man. It's disgusting. I've said it. I've said it. Now it's out in the open, right? Whatever happens to me, fine. If you guys slay me in the media, fine. But don't forget these innocent black lives that have been la lost. Mobile Police Sergeant John Young told reporters more details about the shootings will come out soon. But right now, he says the community needs to focus on the big problem, gun violence. Well, the most important question is, is how do we get these young black men to stop killing black women and children and each other? That's the most important question that no one's asked. Well, Sergeant John Carlos Young just did. Reporting in Mobile, I'm Dana Winter for WKRG News 5.